Okay, this is something that comes up once in a while. These holes right here in the bedside. They're, uh, this is a short, short side bed. And you can tell it's short side because there's no embossment on the side of it. It's all flat steel. And these are access to the Zerk fittings, grease fittings. And that's for the brake light. So you got a hole there. You got a whatever you call it, divot there, and you've got another access hole here. And that's how you usually find them. Here's a, a high side bed, upside down, sitting on this truck. I'll back up so you can see. That's how I bought this one. Bought it just like this. Guy delivered it with a bed on top of a bed. And that's usually what you see. You just see a hole like that. And once in a while, you'll find the rear one with a grommet in it. Protect the wiring that comes out. And this, on some on some types, there's, this is actually a cover that you can take off. Uh, some of the later ones, later beds don't have those. I couldn't tell you right now which bed that is that has the removable cover. This bed I know is a 48. This is my 50 cab with a 48 bed, and that's the hole to the Zerk. That's a hole for the brake lights. And then there's the impression for, for access to the rear suspension. Same thing here. Low side bed, both sides, always empty. Well, that's not the way they're supposed to be. There's actually a cover, a cover plate that goes over them. This is a 50, uh, this truck is kind of a catch-all of parts. Every time I come with some extra parts, I just kind of throw it on this one. It's a 53, um, should be 52, 53 uh, hood. That's easy to tell because of the the uh, way that this body line comes down at the bottom of the hood versus, say, a 4850, which is just a straight drop to the fender. But here's the cover plate right here. <clears throat> it's just like that. And then you have the grommet. Okay, so my buddy Brian, just he was asking what's made of. What it looks like if it's metal. This is it. Right here. This is what it looks like. This is uh, something that is not on every truck. And some guys think another grommet goes in there and doesn't. It's uh, it's a little metal metal cover. I don't know if I can hold this and tap on it. You get the idea. It's metal. Tap out of tune. So, I'm actually stealing these. <laughs> I'm going to put them on this truck right here. So I got one right there. I'm going to go grab the other one on the other side. After uh had a windstorm through here. I live out in California. We had a couple of big storms here and in the uh, beginning of March, just made a lot of <laughs> tore off part of my roof. It's uh, it's crazy. Oh, this one, I don't know if it's gonna come up as good. Uh, looks a little rusty, but actually, it didn't uh, didn't give me any trouble at all, did it? No, well, cleaned it up. See what we can do with it. So, I'll clean those up and pop them on my truck right there. And I've got another truck up front. Well, actually, I got a couple trucks up front to take a look at. And I think can. Enjoy the scenery in front of my house. See all the yard work I got to do. It's a lot of road to take care of right there, by the way. A few dogs, too. That's not Moose. That's a Lily. It's tough being a country dog. She got hit by a truck. That was not cheap. But she's got a bionic hip. <laughs> and God, I love these little dogs. These little dogs take care of the rabbits around here. 
All right, nothing here. I'm going to see if I can uh, find another pair. Grommet. Nothing. But sometimes when you're looking through stuff that's buried in the back, you might come across those and not realize what they are. And here's another short bed. And let's see what's hiding here. And let's see, you just don't come across a lot of them. I think that's why most guys don't know about them. All right, so that's all the trucks I got. I only had those that one pair. That was it. All righty. So if you find those hidden in the cab somewhere, that's uh, that's what you got to do. Save them. Put them in. Make it like it was. All righty. Good luck, guys.